Sisters. Seems good. Yeah, that's fine. Can I know this one that I need to go on? Okay, now without further ado, here we go. Why'd you kill the music? I think you know why. Um, <laughs> I don't think I do. Begins with an L? Like the L word? Lesbians? Lost, Max. We're what? lost. We're just, we're in geographic flux. Right, so, lost. That's the baby. Take a moment to consider the following. 
as it will guide you through the various twists and turns that may appear during your stay at Hackett's Quarry. What you see here are quick time events, or QTEs, which will help you to act at just the right time. Watch your step. Hackett's Quarry can be a dangerous place if you're not paying attention to your surroundings. Take your eye off the ball, and it could spell disaster. The path you tread is yours to choose, but that doesn't mean there won't be obstacles along the way. Oh, heads up. Nice. Yeah, honey, nice catch. Thank you. Man, the roads are definitely getting worse out here. I guess it's all part of the rustic summer camp experience. Oh, right, that's where we're going. I lost track like 200 miles ago. 200 miles ago, huh? Yeah. Welcome to summer camp in the middle of the forest. You know what, Max? It's okay. It doesn't make you any less of a man. You know, if Columbus hadn't gone lost and landed on these golden shores, there would be no United States of America. Goodbye, hot dogs. See you later, apple pie. Columbus never actually landed in North America. What are you talking about? Didn't even know he wasn't in Asia. Are you serious? Just another guy who didn't want to admit he was lost. Well, just another guy who's got a whole day named after him, so put that in your pipe and smoke it. Oh my god. Okay, just get us to camp already before I roll my eyes out of my head, please. <laughs> I'm working on it. I'm working on it. What is that? Yeah, yeah. No, but seriously, what happened to the, the normal map? This is the normal map. The one on the phone. No bars. Of course not. Okay, let's see. So we are... Well, I guess they don't put summer camps on maps. Have you seen any signs for it? Oh, eyes on the road! Christ, what do you think that was? A bear? What? No, no, Max, it wasn't a bear. What was it? I think it was a person. Lou, are you serious? Do you think we hit a person? I don't know. I mean, it was really cl close, like, really close, but maybe we didn't... What is it? I really have this car up. Well, maybe it looks worse than it is. Uh, I should check out the damage before we try to start it up again, huh? Could you grab my, uh, the, the toolbox from the trunk? Yeah, yeah, okay. So bad. My mom's gonna kill me. Did you take her car out? Yeah, you did. How's this thing? At certain times throughout the night, opportunities will present themselves, giving you the chance to take matters into your own hands. 
It is worth noting that they are only suggestions. You don't have to act upon them. In fact, sometimes it's better not to. So you know we're gonna get killed either way. With cutting out, or we don't do anything. Well, we're gonna be a good team now. I'm not stupid. Just gonna get the things and look. Thanks, honey. Yeah. Do you need a hand? Yeah, actually, if you could just shine a light right here. There you go. Perfect, thank you. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Just picture yourself curling up in front of a big old fire pit singing campfire sing-alongs. I don't think people curl up right in front of big old fire pits. Why not? Uh, they don't want to catch on fire. And then... What was that? Picture yourself curling up in front of a big old space heater. Well, anywhere's better than here. Where are you going? Just over here. Just stay there for a second, okay? I'm almost done. Max, hurry up! What's going on? I'm worried that there's somebody down there. Are you serious? Yeah, I, I, they could be hurt. I don't know. I didn't think we actually hit anyone. Well, I don't know. I just, I heard something, okay? Like a, a woman. Do you think we hit her? I just want to check it out. Okay. All right. Just don't go too far, okay? Be careful. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Luck with the car. Where are you? Oh, no, you've done it. The people have seen to know what's going on.
It's okay, it's the woods. There's a lot of stuff out there. There's animals, it's easy to freak yourself out. No. Can we just leave, please? Yeah, 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 let's go. Okay. You all right? Yes, there we go, Fern like a kid. Max, come on! Here we go, here we go, we're getting out of here. You're not helping right now. Can you just... I am trying to get us out of here. All right, just... enough! Shit, I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. We're okay. We're safe in the car, really. We're gonna be okay. Jeez. Oh, ah. fuck! Oh, my God, my heart just exploded. Roll it down. Uh -huh. Stop the how are you doing this evening? Are either of you injured? Really, we're fine. We're just a little shaken up. Mm -hmm. Well, you folks want to tell me what happened here? <laughs> We, um, uh, something jumped out right in front of the car and we didn't want to hit it, so we swerved and now here we are. Something jumped out. <laughs> An animal. <laughs> you know, yeah. Um, it's just, it, it, don't know what kind. It was so fast and. Yeah. Well, it was most likely a deer. <laughs> Sir? Keep the car running. Sir? <laughs> is this kind of like the all time scariest car? I don't know. This is my first cop. What, like ever? Uh, yeah, I'm not a criminal. folks want to tell me just what in the hell you are doing all the way out here this late at night. We're heading up to Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. We're new counselors. You're one night early. No, no, we know. Um, but we figured we'd get in early and scope it out, you know? I mean, they know we're coming. We called ahead. And to be honest, sir, one of us kind of oversold their navigation skills and got us completely lost. <sighs> You're not gonna make it to Haggett's quarry. Why? Why? Not tonight. Harbinger Motel. It's the nearest place you can bunk up there for the night, okay? Uh, I think we're just gonna stick to the plan, sir. I mean, Mr. Hackett knows we're coming and we called ahead. No, ma'am, you're gonna head to the Harbinger Motel. Do you understand? Oh, yes. Okay, fine. 
Yeah, we'll head to the motel. Understood. Uh, there's just one small problem. Uh, I forgot to spring for the middle of nowhere coverage plan on my phone. What he means is we're lost completely. All right, ma'am. Step out of the vehicle. Wait, what? Uh, I just want to show you how to get to the motel on your map there. Okay? For sure. Son, remain in the vehicle. Okay. I think you should come around to the other side of the car to do this. Okay. So we. Why did he just do that? About here. Harbinger Motel is here. Right. Okay. And where was Hackett's quarry again? We've well, to it. I'm sure the fine folks. The Harbinger Motel can guide you there first thing in the morning. Right. Harbinger Motel. Stay on the road. Watch out for potholes. Don't you need like Have a, a statement? Good night. Okay, that was it. So what was the end? I should have risen slumbering. No. Why is this guy just sitting there? Giving me major weirdo The dude needed like at least a dozen shots. Oh my god, I know. What was up with the thing? Did I you see was, that? Was it blood? Nice to meet you. <laughs> oh my god. Oh man. <sighs> All right, let's get back on the road. Yes. I think I've had enough woodland encounters for one night. Thank you very much. Agreed. So where's this motel? Okay, so we're here, mm -hmm. and the motel is here. Okay. But we're going here. What's there? Hackett's quarry. <laughs> How'd you do that? I don't know, I kind of tricked him into showing you. <laughs> Very slick. Are you sure we shouldn't just get to the motel and just listen to this guy's advice? Honey, you really want to listen to the advice of some creep-ass cop who told us in the middle of the creep-ass woods to go to some creep-ass hotel? No, that sounds terrible. Let's get around, shall we? That's what I thought. Ma'am. Oh my god! If he called me ma'am one more time, I was gonna shove that badge up his dick hole. <laughs> Seriously, do I look like a ma'am to you? I got like 20 years before I'm a ma'am. Mm-hmm. What? I... 20 is... debatable. Easy. I mean, I'm kind of into ma'ams. <laughs> oh, <laughs> You gotta be kidding me. There's nobody here. We drive all the way the fuck out Max, here. Max, can we just look around before we jump to conclusions? Did you actually even talk to Mr. Hackett or did you just leave a message? Well, what's the difference? This, this is the difference. Hello? I guess he doesn't check his voicemail. How was I supposed to know that? I mean, clearly there's somebody here. Yeah, or it's just an abandoned car and this is a complete waste Why of time. Why would there be an abandoned... I'll be at the car. Max, come on. Max, don't be a dick. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It isn't going to open this nobody here. Is anybody home?
as if you were shot over there by heads, you need to get around those in the same things. So you made about the same thing you were told to on the movies, choose where the camera goes. So you just left them walking into things. Empty office. What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. You ready to roll? What's that is? I'll be right back. I'm gonna get some help. Max! Max, get over here! What's going on? There's somebody in the bunker. I think they might be stuck. Stuck? Is it Mr. Hackett? I, I don't know. Just bring some tools so we can break the lock. Hey, I'm back. We're gonna get you out of there. What are these? I don't know. You just... Why didn't you just bring the... Look, there's someone in there. Um, I'm not seeing anyone. Like, no, look. I'm looking. I am. Let me see. There was not that before. There, there was definitely someone there. Okay. Okay. So... Sure, it's gonna be super loud. Yeah, okay. Wrenches. Damn. So she won't think I should do that. You need a hand? Yeah. You've seen the evil dead, right? Hello? Who was in the first three? Not the remake one. Or the TV series. So you to watch them. Are you hurt? You exist? Hey. 
Be careful. And maybe it was a possum or something. No, there was there was someone here, I swear. Hey, it's been kind of a night, you know? Let's just get to the motel. We can come back here first thing in the morning. We can check everything out, but... I mean, you must be exhausted. I know I am. I think our imagination... <laughs> Hello, my friend. Welcome to the show. We are friends, aren't we? I've waited for you. I've waited. Yes. So I do hope our time together proves enlightening. There's no need to worry. I'm here to help you. Think of me as your guide, 
into the unknown. It's exciting, yes, and terrifying. But if you're brave enough, if you let me help you, I can help you. We can help each other. This is the card you found. <laughs> the fool. I wonder who this is. We all know a fool when we see one, don't we? <laughs> Innocence and freedom. Or recklessness and risk-taking. Spontaneity. Actions without thought, but the consequences to match. Think. Think, and don't get burnt. I can show you more if you'd like me to. This is what <laughs> might come <laughs> to pass. A path, <laughs> a path yet unchosen. Look here, look here. There are secrets out there, you know. Secrets and lies. Paths to uncover on which I can shed light, if you let me. Help me help you. And remember, what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Love. See you later, kids. Yeah, hack its quarry forever. <laughs> you know how many hearts are broken in the last day of summer camp? It's like a romance apocalypse. Yeah, well, I mean, they're just kids. You know, they'll get over it. Uh-huh. Like they'll get over Emma? Well, that's not the same thing. <laughs> oh, so that's not why you're in a bad mood. I'm not in a bad... Oh, my. <laughs> you know what? We had our last night together, and we're cool. Oh, yeah. So cool that you're never going to see your special little boo-boo bear ever again. <laughs> oh, come on, dude. The cabin walls are made of band-aids and rat turds. <laughs> okay, I get it. <laughs> Hi, Emma. Hey. <laughs> okay, this is, um... You've heard of spatial awareness before, yeah. right? Spatial awareness is for nerds. Uh, be a lamb and grab the last couple of bags, will ya? Yes, boss. Say hi to Emma for me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am. I have to get emotional, emotional. I have to get emotional. 